Hello and welcome. What's your name? My name is Yavuz. I'm Mitin. Nice to meet you. Yavuz, what do you do? What is your profession? I'm a student. Which university? Chonkia University. Well, nice. So what do you do as your extracurricular activity? How do you spend your time? I prefer spending time with my friends, or I can take time out for myself. Yeah, something like that. How are you with science? I mean, I can say that it's out of my league, really, but let's just say I try to read as much as I can. I try to stay up to date. Mostly, I read about genetics, so let's just say I try to keep up with it. That's great. Now, we've been looking into a few scientific developments. We read about them and thought about going out and sharing them with people so they can also benefit. Maybe you're studying these things that I'm going to share with you coincidentally. Let me tell you about one of those things. At Stony Brook University in the U.S., a study was conducted on sleep. The research found that when people sleep on their right side, a cleansing activity in the brain takes place that prevents the possible onset of Alzheimer's and Parkinson's diseases. It's an astonishing find, really, a fine, sensitive thing. But it's not just that. For instance, a person can sleep on his left side as well. When you sleep on your left side, organs pile up on your heart and put pressure on it. This makes it unable to perform as usual. But when you sleep on your right side, the heart stays on top and operates normally as usual, and the person starts the day energetically. Sleeping on your right side has an actual health benefit. Another thing is pouring cold water on your feet just before leaving a shower. Do you do this? To be honest, just before finishing a shower, I bathe in cold water for a few minutes. But as I said, I didn't know about pouring water on the feet. I mean, I didn't know. This has the following benefits. A person using hot water, it doesn't matter whether for a long period or a short period, staying under hot water causes blood activity to increase in the expanded vessels. So, once blood circulation starts to accelerate, the body's defense mechanism begins to strengthen. It reduces the risk of a person's blood pressure dropping. It is a very simple practice, isn't it? Putting your feet in cold water on the way out. The information mentioned above, when you take a look, it has come to light only within last 100 or 150 years.